tech guru cool again so today uh, we are going to experience explore and install uh, chrome os flex which is available now so it's basically a, a like network based operating system where you don't need to install all the uh, everything on the on your machine and it, it, it it's a lightweight operating system provided with chrome os okay so basically there are two options to install this so one you can install it on your system uh, so for that you need to follow uh, the following uh, so you need to just fill up the forms Okay, size something I can give this I am I can I'm giving this name as a test company okay, something um, you, you can uh, fill this accordingly basically software country mine is in India so I in DIA is not coming so okay give me one second so we'll choose you, you can choose uh, I just uh, basically fill the form and then you will have a uh, so in DIA, I'll give something nine 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 nine. Okay, something I've given. So if you want, you can click this, and then you can do try OS FX view installation guide. So this will guide you through the process. So created us so first we need to create a usb drive and uh, so you need to insert a usb drive this device you you create usb can different from device plan install process okay so this this you can follow so this is the link so we we are not going to try this method because i don't want to install it on my system currently so i'll i'll use the uh, vm uh, vmware uh, image for this so like this you can move forward next start using chrome fx you need to build a usb you can create a usb so you can follow these steps okay, okay. go to chrome store at top right chrome so these things you can follow okay okay so like this you can create a usb uh, for that and uh, you can use that uh, that to install you can boot it boot your system with that usb and you can install like this so but we'll not uh, use this we'll just try the uh, look and feel of this operating system and see like how it looks so i'm 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 tr using this link so i am i will give these links in the description also you can download it from there so i'll i have uh, so you can uh, use this link to download the uh, download the image file image file for virtual box uh, sorry vm player okay so I have already downloaded it. If you can see it, look this this one. So I can see. So this is there in the my uh, uh, cloud ready home. So this this is there in my download. So I can use this to uh, install or get it into the VM player. So let's open this. So you you need to install uh, this if you don't have. This is just just a virtual machine you you can boot and boot any system or you can create a new virtual machine i can try without installing it on a system so it's basically basically a virtualization tool which provide you uh, a facility to install any operating system on your machine or you utilize your resources uh, or test uh, any system okay so like that so i have this uh, in my download folder so i'll try to open this okay so look so this is that okay so name of the new virtual machine this i'll give C H R O M E chrome flex o s f l e x t e s t okay t e s t okay and this location you can give accordingly wherever you want so i'll, I'll just try to have on this uh, let's have VMS so virtual machine okay import so this will import now meanwhile uh, it, it it is importing it will not take much time so I'll not pause the video so
okay so let let's let it import then we will explore it okay so okay meanwhile you can wait or uh, mean meanwhile it's importing uh, we can read through this so some additional notes so basically uh, we can read something about this meanwhile okay so this is basically So as an admin, you can install Chrome OS FLX on Windows MS device. So user can mainly features that eligible for Chrome devices. Include. Okay. So this is the basic step. I'll try it. Okay. So this is the basic requirement. If you can see minimum device requirement, this is important actually. So uh, so your system should be like uh, a 64 bit uh, compatible device. RAM should be 4 GB internal storage should be 16 gb and you have to have a usb where you can make it bootable and you can boot it from uh, that usb into your system and install it then bios full administrator access you need to boot from the chrome os flex usb uh, why you need this because you if uh, the usb is not set to bootable or uh, it's not fast device to boot from you can change it accordingly processor and graphics card uh, if it's not very compulsory but basically this is the basic requirement you can see okay and let's see uh, let's see if it is uh, uh, one second so it's still important we can see some other things okay community okay so this is this is also a community uh, i'll support a google chrome flex okay so this also i'll give into into the uh, your help uh, description help so you can you can uh, use this so here you can paste your uh, post your uh, like um, issues and comments uh, and this community will help you okay so I think it has been imported so let's boot this system up so RAM 4GB it's already it's automatically available so when you have a virtual machine uh, you don't need to make any changes you just you just have to it's if uh, oh, it's already OVA is basically a full fledged system which is already configured if you have ISO you may have to configure certain things but this is OVA file, so it's already uh, pre-configured and everything. So it, it has already chosen uh, 4GB RAM. Uh, so let's play it. Okay, let's see if it boots up or not. I'm also trying for the first time. So okay, let's see. So let's see how much time it takes, basically. Let's see. I have already started. Okay. I'm not sure. It's still booting. Let's see. So uh, I think it's almost six forty seconds or so. So let's see if it boots up or not. Okay. Not sure why. It, okay. Let's see. Uh, it's taking some time to boot up. Let's see. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm also booting for the first time, so I'm not sure about that. I have never installed it. So this is the hard disk which is assigned to it. This is the network adapter. I'm not sure. Oh, 
okay give i'll stop this video for now and let's I, i'll wait for it to boot then we can explore the os i won't don't want to waste your time uh, seeing this booting so i'll stop this now and let's uh, meet once it uh, gets booted up thank you okay so i'm still waiting for this to boot up it didn't boot up actually didn't power up so i think this option um, is not working so it just shows this and after this it gone it goes blank I'm not sure what is happening and uh, not none of these works nothing works so it's just a black screen so maybe we should try installing that using the chrome the like google try method okay so it failed basically so uh, i think this method uh, which it shows uh, this one so this i think does not work or let's read if something there uh just run exi works just in 14 and fusion 10 do not work on we work on 15 or testing but does it we will pro okay does not work on we may play linux in our testing cloud ready will not work in okay so maybe uh, what i am using that is that falls in in this so you can try avoiding this and uh, try installing it so mine is <laughs> uh mine installation failed actually so better we can try this method okay so that will be better so you follow this and try to install it and if you succeed please let me know uh if you, i don't have a like machine which where i can uh, remove windows or mac and install this so i'll stop it here only so chrome os uh yet to be tested and yet to be tried so i think it should be uh, google should provide an iso for this for testing purpose that i'll advise so let's see when it comes thanks for watching uh, let's uh, try this these things and let's fail and succeed so thanks for watching let's connect some with some uh, some other time and do something else thank you Thank you.